It's time for another mini merch, and today I've got a Wonder Woman colouring book, or a colouring book, as the Americans say, apparently, because they can't figure out how to use use in, in words. Yes, Wonder Woman colouring book, high quality images, 50 giant pages. Ooh, yeah. So, what are these high quality images like? Well, oh, God's so bright. There's an image. There's an image. There's an image. Uh, uh, side on. There's an image. <laughs> and these are the high quality images. Alright. Excellent. I was going through this just before I started filming. Just to check it out. Just to see, you know, make sure it was alright. And all these images are sort of this sort of Wonder Woman, this old school sort of Wonder Woman image. With the uh, little underwears and the tiara. Except for this image, this one lone image, which, which is obviously Gal Gadot in like Batman v Superman in the promo images from that, and the new updated Wonder Woman logo. It's very strange. It's all, it's all this sort of Wonder Woman, and then just bam, just that one there, that one image of the modern Wonder Woman. It's very strange. What a random selection of images, and for some reason she's got a bunch of flowers there. Like she's off on a date. Yes, well I'm sure I will enjoy colouring these in. They seem very basic. What was that I just saw? Um, who are they? Well that's Cheetah obviously, and that, that's Black Manta. Who's that? I can't tell. Because she's behind. Uh, mm, oh well. Uh, never mind. That's strange. Yeah, she doesn't usually fight Black Manta. And he's got some very feminine legs. <laughs> Who is that? Strange, she's got a little mini skirt on. Oh well, doesn't matter. Yeah, these are some basic images. Oh, there's another one of her and Cheetah. She looks annoyed. She looks, well, she looks kind of annoyed as well. That's not a good day for either of them. And she's randomly chasing this guy. Well, I thought it was a policeman, but no, he's obviously not. Yeah. Right, these are very basic images. So they shouldn't be too hard to colour in. Just this random modern one. Uh, what's on the back? Oh, there is a sort of modern image on the back as well. Okay. What's inside? That, but the other way around. And, I don't know, something tells me this is really cheaply printed and uh, produced. There's something about the feel of it. Uh, yep, yeah. yeah, printed in Poland by Amazon Fulfillment. Fair enough. Just the feel of this, the sort of cheap cardboard on the back, the cheap card even on the back, and the, the basic, the very basic images just doesn't scream high quality to me. So anyway, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> I know it says high quality images, but I'm not getting that feel. So I'm going to pick one to cut, pick an image to colour, I think this one actually. I'm going to colour this in and after a jump cut, sorry there was a bit of, I was blowing on the screen, there was a bit of hair on the screen, let's get that off. I'm going to colour this in and you'll have a jump cut and you'll see what I've done. Yeah, so I'll see you in a little while and this will be coloured in. And I'm done! Yes, uh, as you can see, I finished. And even a little bit of artistic integrity with this ring around her as well. Yep, finished. Done it. Look at me. Ch check me out. Staying in the lines. Yeah. That's some good quality colouring. Yeah. <clears throat> May not be that vibrant because I don't think I have the best quality pencils in the world. But look at me. I'm so proud of myself for finishing this. Yeah. Woo. Excellent. Yay. That was actually quite fun. But you know what I've noticed um, about this whole book? Um, you can't really see it on this picture because I've already been colouring it in. But let's pick this one, for instance. You, the, if you zoom in really close, you can see this isn't like dirt or anything on the page. It's just really badly pixelated. The images are really, really really pixelated. It's it's super obvious that this has been 
this is imprinted from like a computer or something. It's so obvious. This is how cheap this is. I knew I knew it felt cheap, and now I just if I can get it. I just I knew it felt cheap, and now I just now I just it's just confirmed. Oh, this camera! You know I spent a lot of money on this camera, and uh, I can't figure out the zoom. Someone needs to t I I looked at tutorials. All right, here we go. See, see these edges, the edges here. Yeah. That, that's not like dust or anything. That's how pixelated it is. Because this is obviously just printed from a computer. Yeah, that is that is quite cheap. That is quite bad. As, as bits of merchandise go. But if you look at it from a distance, it's fine. And this is for kids. So let's, let's not forget. And it was only about £3 on Amazon. So I really can't complain that much. So, but... I, I, I don't know if it's my pencils or the paper, but it's not actually that you know the colors don't really show up too great, but that's probably just the pencils. It does feel like I think it's just normal a four regular paper, so I'm not gonna complain too much because it was quite nice to color in and it is just a basic little book for kids, so yeah, Wonder Woman coloring book fifty gi giant pages. I don't think so. Regular A4 pages. High quality? Mm, not so much. And something else I realised as well. It doesn't say what's inside, it says what inside. Uh, there's something a little bit off about this whole book. But anyway, Wonder Woman colouring book. Get your own if you dare. Alright, see you again soon for another mini merch. Bye!